Hello everyone, myself, lecturer Aditya Anil Tushar, Master of Pharmacy in Quality Assurance Techniques. Today we are going to discuss about the experiments from Pharmaceutics 2. So first of all discuss about the monophasic liquid dosage forms, liquid mean for external administration, in that specially liquids to be instilled into the body cavities, ophthalmic preparations that are eye preparations. These are sterile preparations meant for installation into the eye in the space between the eyelid and eyeballs. These products must be sterile and are prepared under the same conditions and by the same methods. Recommended containers for eye drops are sterile bottle or vial fitted with a dropper in a cap and special labeling instructions for eye drop are for external use only. In next session we will discuss in detail about the experiment. So now let's discuss about experiment number 29. Title of our today's experiment is to prepare and dispense the atropine sulfate eye drop 10 ml. This is the formulation and method of preparation of eye drop by maintaining the isotonicity. Proposition 1. When the medicament is added to an isotonic solution, the product will be hypertonic. This may not be important since the eye can tolerate a range equivalent to 0.6 to 1.4% sodium chloride solution. A method has been devised to overcome the difficulty of speedy extemporaneous dispensing. Learning objectives of our today's experiments are to understand the purpose of maintaining isotonicity in the preparation of eye drop and ability to prepare eye drop correctly by following procedure of rapid adjustment to isotonicity and label it properly. Apparatus required are beaker, pipette, stirrer, funnel. All are sterile previously. Factor calculated as quantity required upon quantity given that is equal to 10 upon 100 is equal to 0.1. This is the prescription given. Atropine sulfate 1% sterile water quantity sufficient normal saline solution 30 ml. Let's discuss about formulation table type that is use of ingredient translation means name of ingredient quantity given in the imperial system for preparing 30 ml quantity given in the metric system for preparing 30 ml quantity taken in the metric system for actual preparation of 10 ml atropine sulfate used as antiseptic anti-infective quantity given 1% means 1 gram for in 100 ml so multiply it with factor 0.1 we will get 0.1 gram sterile water used as a vehicle quantity sufficient 100 ml so for preparing 10 ml quantity sufficient up to 10 ml normal saline solution used as a tonicity adjuster quantity given 30 ml multiply it with factor we will get quantity given uh, taken as 3 ml direction as directed by physician for performing actual experiment let's move towards laboratory now let's move towards actual performing of experiment in laboratory so we have this is sodium chloride from which we will already prepare this normal saline uh, solution and this is atropine sulfate which is api in this particular experiment and this is the water sterile water so first of all we are going to add this is Previously weighed atropine sulfate, we are going to add this atropine sulfate into this normal saline solution which is previously prepared from this sodium chloride. Then after uh, properly stirring it, now I am going to add this saline sterile water into it, then properly mix it. So now I will transfer it into measuring cylinder for volume makeup and after making the volume up to 10 ml then we will transfer it into this proper uh, eye drop bottle and after that we will proceed for labeling part so now move for the labeling part so as the labeling of formulation eye drop 10 ml for abc means name of patient register number that is xyz number given in the register dispensed by pqr means the name of pharmacist date September 2020 that is the manufacturing date storage condition store in a cool and damp place check well before use then another direction for external use only used as directed by physician also the one more directions for the eye drop that is used within the one month after opening the container and if any irritation persists that patient may can visit to doctor
inspection with special instruction on label as for extra use.